What is up everybody, Hayden and Dave, welcome back to the Hunter Call of the Wild, and today we're finally back at the Trophy Lodge. It has been several months, I think, since we last did a Trophy Lodge tour, so I don't know, I just kind of wanted to come in here, that way y'all could see how all of this has changed over the past couple months. Um... There are certain areas that have changed more than others, like this room over here has not changed much. But you go further in the back, it's changed quite a lot since the last time. So let's go on ahead and get into this. Starting off right here, we have a multi-mount that will probably never go away unless I get a bigger rare or a bigger diamond. We have our 270 diamond fallow deer with our gold melanistic and our gold Piebald. And actually, I have two gold piebalds, but this is the biggest of the two, scoring just over 200. Then, right here, we have a 282.6 whitetail um, back from before their scoring was changed. Then, we have a piebald um, gold. I just shot this on my Revan Tuli the other day. And then a 272.4, which is my biggest diamond whitetail since they got changed. Then right over here we have an albino European rabbit, which is something we found while trying to find a diamond. Um, here's a big gemsbuck diamond female from quite a long time ago. Uh, this is one of my diamond tundra bean geese. I really like this one. Um, this was the smaller of the two, but I think it's got a pretty neat fur type. Then there's my old rack diamond axis deer, um, and then the new true rack diamond axis deer. Um, this one was actually like a legitimate diamond. This is not one of the ones when they were super common. Then we have a uh, diamond smallhorn springbuck, diamond mouflon, diamond male gemsbuck, troll gray mouflon, uh, max score male gemsbuck, another diamond mouflon, and a, another diamond smallhorn springbuck. Then right here behind us, we have our diamond scrub hair and our diamond European hair. Um, right here we have my biggest diamond harlequin duck. I believe this one was also a max weight, just not quite max score. Here's our diamond cottontail rabbit. Um, up here on the wall we have a diamond seeker deer, diamond mule deer, diamond roosevelt, diamond fallow deer, another diamond seeker, and then two diamond moose. Come into this room, definitely one of my favorites. Starting off you have our melanistic roosevelt elk which is a product of our jackrabbit grind, and then an albino female mountain lion. I uh, have a diamond harlequin duck there, and a really, really big, almost diamond, melanistic European rabbit. Um, up here we have a melanistic gold kudu, um, one of my two diamond chamois. Then we have our three diamond Rocky Mountain elk, all big horns. Um, two diamond pronghorns each with like the highest some of the highest scores you can get for that rack variation um big piebald diamond uh diamond true x black buck um another diamond true x black buck diamond pronghorn my biggest piebald to this day another diamond true x black buck a diamond big horn spring buck then a diamond a legacy rack kudu and another diamond bighorn springbuck. Then over this way, we have our diamond European rabbit, which took forever to find, but we finally got them. Um, a diamond feral goat and a diamond mixed feral goat. Now this one was shot before they were rare, so this is not a super rare. Uh, up here is one of our two bighorns diamond Cape Buffalo. Right here we have a bigger diamond coyote, also a product of the jackrabbit grind and our diamond mexican bobcat then right here we have an albino male coyote this was from when rancho first came out then a melanistic diamond mallard which looks really good now that like the ducks kind of like got they're like i don't know they got fixed i think the mallards look a lot better than they used to and the melanistic looks so good you can see like little hints of blue and green in there it's so cool um, I really want to, f oh, what am I doing? <laughs> Sorry. Uh, I really want to find a blonde female mallard to put in this spot. 
but they are actually a rare now, so they're going to be a little, more, little bit more difficult to find. And then we have our gold leucistic mallard. Um, here's my only gold rare mule deer. It's piebald, a 267 uh, red deer, and a 269 fallow deer, my second biggest one ever. So that kind of concludes the front of the lodge. Now we start getting into the good stuff. Right here we have our diamond eastern turkey, albino female spring buck, uh, leucistic black buck. Um, this is my gold leucistic eastern turkey, uh, diamond white tail, diamond bighorn sheep, troll pronghorn. I really need to change that. I want to put something else there. And then our diamond mountain goat. This was, I believe, one of my biggest ones. Then right here we have our diamond uh caribou no reindeer excuse me this is was a max weight i found it on a multiplayer server then the 442 the one that has like the rack almost kind of like touching that was the product of my reindeer grind took me like 450 kills to get that guy and then we have a leucistic then up here we have light gray leucistic goose uh diamond goose these are all canada geese uh, gray. Um, this is a really big piebald caribou that I found. Um, another diamond. My gold bald leucistic. Probably my favorite goose yet. And then a gold brown hybrid from back when they were, I guess you could say, actually uncommon. Kind of rare, maybe. I don't know. But here's a diamond cinnamon teal. A diamond capercaid. I think this was my level 2 diamond. And then a diamond harlequin duck. Uh, right here, I have my biggest diamond red deer to this day, 268.5, with a piebald female. And then, the best multi-mount in the entire lodge, Melanistic Diamond Grizzly with an albino mythical. By far my favorite multi-mount in this entire trophy lodge. It is so cool. I, the, I, I don't even know how many hours I put into grizzly bears. I know it was a lot. And I'm so happy to have found these things. So right here we have smaller diamond plains bison. Um, this was a diamond small horns cape buffalo. My gold albino. I'd like to have a leucistic and a melanistic to go here. But I'll have to like really start hunting plains bison again. Which is something I haven't done in quite a while actually. Um, and then up here we have a troll water buffalo. Uh, right here we have our first diamond black grouse. Um, which we got on opening day of Evan Tooley. And then the thing that took absolutely forever to find, a 6.4 diamond white-tailed jackrabbit. That was probably the hardest grind I've ever done in terms of wanting to continue. And I'm so glad I got them when I did because now their drink zones are gone on Layton. And I think they're a little bit harder to find. And they were already hard enough as it was. This is my gold albino Truax Kudu. I wish he was a little bit more even, but he definitely does look pretty cool. So I'm not upset about that. Um, I'm glad the lion's mane's kind of got fixed. Um, this is my brown diamond Cape Buffalo back when they were on common. My 49.3 diamond lion, blonde female, and then just a common female. I need to get another rare female to go right there. Um, up here, we have uh, my albino female brown bear, something that I thought was pretty cool. Um, this is my gold bighorns diamond wildebeest, a, another diamond plains bison. This is actually a mixed feral goat from when they were rare, so they're rare now. I got this one fairly recently. Uh, this is a black feral goat, so that is really rare. I got both of these guys in the same zone, like a day apart. Um, and multiplayer. Uh, this is, I think, my biggest ever diamond feral goat, 219.9. Then up here we have some ducks and geese. We've got a max score diamond Eurasian teal, um, a diamond tufted duck. Right here we've got a leucistic tundra bean goose, just a female, still pretty cool. Here we've got uh, just a couple diamond fallow deer. Some that I thought were pretty special. The 260.6 is actually a max weight. So the fact that he scored that low I thought was kind of funny. 
Um, and then we have the 265.2. One of these, I think it's this one was my first ever Diamond Validir. So that's always pretty neat. Then right here we have a 4.7 Diamond Caper Kaylee. I want to make sure I didn't miss any other small plaques. Uh, Diamond Small Horns Warthog. My Troll Rodier, of course. I had a Diamond um, back in the winter, I think. But um, he ended up getting deleted on accident. And now I don't have him anymore. So that's kind of sad. So um, this is a little piebald male as well. Then over here we've got our albino male Rocky Mountain Elk. Definitely something that's pretty cool. Um, my smaller of my two diamond widgeon. And then my melanistic gold lynx. This is probably... Uh, probably my second favorite trophy in the lodge. Next to that melanistic diamond grizzly. I mean, this thing is unreal. Like, these guys are so, so rare. And the fact that I got him as an initial spawn, he was a max weight estimate and everything. I mean, it's just, I don't even know what to say. That was one of my coolest kills. So let's go down this hallway. We've got a small horns diamond red deer, or one of the small horns. Piebald, a big horns, big horns. Uh, diamond chamois. Um, this was the wonky rack. This is a red spotted sea deer. Now that they're rare. Uh, diamond blue wildebeest and my gold albino. Albino male red deer. Uh, this was just a big, uh, big teal, and a big widgeon that I taxed early on. Uh, here's my diamond pheasant. This is another thing that took absolutely forever to find, but I'm super happy I got them. And then another Diamond Plains Bison. There's a lot of Diamond Plains Bison in here from when I did a Plains Bison grind a while back. So right here we have a Diamond Mallard. Um, and then right here we've got a Diamond Black Grouse. And another Diamond Mallard. This one's a brown hybrid. And he's actually a level 2 Diamond. So that was pretty cool. Then we've got an albino uh, female Merriam Turkey. Um one of my larger diamonds to this day not my biggest but one of my bigger ones and then this is a uh light brown from when they were actually rare or i guess you could say rare um up here we've got small horns diamond uh, red deer diamond uh feral goat the only one i have with that rack shape then another small horns diamond red deer we have a leucistic reindeer albino mule deer this is another diamond roosevelt elk um, then right here, Pieball Mule Deer, Melanistic Mule Deer, Diamond Caribou. This was a product of my fox grind. I was hunting foxes on my own Yukon, and he just showed up. I shot like half a dozen caribou, and he happened to show up. Didn't make diamond, but by, what is that, by like 0.3, but still, pretty cool kill. This was actually my 200th diamond. So, and I believe now I'm at a uh, hunting profile I'm at 239. So we've already gotten 30 diamonds or excuse me, 40 diamonds roughly since the end of May. Uh, right here we have a melanistic female mountain goat. And I believe that is everything in this room. Also the pieball blacktail. So let's continue down the hallway in here. Uh, this room is definitely a work in progress. It is kind of rough around the edges, but there's a few areas I'd like to improve. But this is probably a multi-mount that will stay. We have a massive melanistic mouflon, along with the phantasma, ogro, and sombra wolves from the Quatricolinus missions. So that is really cool. Then up there, we got a diamond feral goat, actual rare light brown turkey, melanistic caribou, and then a 260.1 diamond Faladir. Uh, right here is my biggest diamond caper, Kaylee. It was a 4.93. Then we have a, another small horns diamond red deer. Diamond black bear. That is my biggest. I have three. Two or three diamond black bear. And that's the biggest one. Um, this was not part of the grind either. This was from a while ago. Uh, 263 diamond Faladir. These are my two biggest bobwhite quail yet. 
Uh, this male right here was almost a level 3. He was really, really close. Unfortunately, the males cannot make it, um, which I think is unfortunate. But either way, and then this is my biggest female so far at 254.8. So, I don't know. I'm still looking for one. I need to check Mississippi. I haven't checked in quite a while. So, here is a Diamond Puma. My actually only Diamond Puma. Along with a Diamond Blacktail. Uh, also, my only Diamond Blacktail. Both took a long time to find. But, that's alright. Right here we have a Blonde Piebald Male Raccoon. Uh, Piebald European Bison. And then up here we have a couple of Troll Moose. Which really unfortunate. Um, a nice Piebald I got on Yukon the other day. And then a couple of Female Diamond Gemsbuck. Actually only one. And then my largest and only level 2 Diamond Whitetail. Got that like the second day Reverend Tulu was out I think. So let's continue into these rooms, or actually we'll do this little spot right here. I have an albino harlequin duck male, uh, diamond, my biggest diamond plains bison, my only diamond water buffalo, my only diamond European bison, and my biggest diamond cape buffalo. So right here I have a fairly large uh, mountain hare, actually the only one that was in the max weight estimate that I've shot yet. So, this is where a diamond one will go once I get it. Right here we have our only diamond raccoon. It's a blonde 12.1. Have an albino feral pig, along with a diamond feral pig, my largest diamond feral pig. A black gold male wild boar. And a max weight diamond wild boar. Good ways off max score though. Then if we go in here, we have just my biggest hazel grouse yet. Um, don't have anything on those plaques. Got a diamond male cape buffalo, diamond cape buffalo, uh, diamond cinnamon teal, diamond mallard. Then up here we have a, another diamond feral pig, a melanistic chamois, uh, 265 diamond red deer, a, another diamond feral pig, and my only diamond wild hog. Um, I, the, if you notice, there's a whole bunch of diamond feral pigs that's because i found several of the level fives while trying to find a diamond european rabbit because at the time they inhabited the same area so right here we have a uh diamond mustier my only one um diamond eurasian teal melanistic harlequin duck fairly close to diamond um have a diamond fallow deer Diamond Wildebeest, Melanistic Male Brown Bear, Diamond Bighorn, Big Brack, uh, Diamond Fallow Deer, Diamond Red Deer, Diamond Mallard, my biggest one. That was also my first one. Killed that one back in 2020. And then, actually, that was, was that Christmas? Must be. That must have been on Christmas the 25th. Maybe? I don't know. Um, and then... Yeah, that was Christmas. Okay. And then this guy right here was my max weight diamond, Tough the Duck. Then up here we have an albino male plains bison, albino male plains bison, albino female warthog, red female warthog, um, albino gold water buffalo, and then my big tusk diamond warthog. Fortunately, there's no video for that guy, but it's okay. Uh, right here we have my piebald raccoon dog, along with I think my second largest willow ptarmigan now i need to change it out i have a 265 it was actually diamond weight just wasn't big enough for the score and was not a level three so right here we have my bigger of my two diamond widgeon and then another diamond eurasian teal um i have three diamond teal and i still don't have a single diamond golden eye kind of annoying um one diamond lynx two diamond lynx uh, this was actually the one I killed on Revan Um This is my big diamond caribou. I killed this guy in a grind as well, kind of like the reindeer. And it only took 75 kills, whereas the reindeer grind took 450. But each grind, I had, I think, four trolls in total. So, like, I had four trolls in a diamond within 75 kills on Yukon. 
and I had four trolls on a diamond within 450 kills on Medved. So I think my Yukon just has like a high probability of spawning level five caribou because there's been times like I've shot literally five caribou and one of them will come back as a five. So I think that's just my map being stupid. Everyone's map spawns different animals different ways. Um, right here is my max weight diamond Sika deer. And we've got one of my biggest diamond gray wolves. We've got a whole bunch of diamond gray wolves up here from the red fox grind. And then diamond Iberian wolf. My only one of those. So, and then let's go on ahead, hop back here to the main room. I still need to put something on that plaque right there. I haven't decided what yet, but we'll come up with something eventually. So starting off in here, we have a diamond male tundra bean goose and a diamond gray lag goose. Um, also have a couple of brown hybrid geese and a gray. These were back when they were actually harder to find than they are now. Uh, right here we have our melanistic gold lesser kudu. I think this is a bigger of the two. And then an albino female. My leucistic collared peccary. Along with my max weight max score diamond. Um, up here this wall needs a lot of improvement. We have troll caribou. Tiny piebald red deer. Diamond fallow deer. This is actually something I am planning on keeping here. This is my most recent diamond spring buck. I found him on my map before the reset. He's really big, 114.2 is massive. Um, troll black buck, legacy horns, uh, diamond small horn spring buck, diamond piebald mallard, troll spring buck, and just a large caribou. Then right here we have my biggest rare red deer, piebald, I think that's a pretty cool one, with a piebald hind. Right here we have a melanistic gold mountain lion along with, I think, my biggest piebald blacktail. Um, right here we have diamond uh, Rio Grande and Merriam turkeys. And then right here we have our diamond two-tones male gray fox. Definitely something I really, really wanted. Probably my most wanted diamond on Mississippi actually for a while. And I finally got him. Um... And then right here, we have a rare egg white wolf. Um, then a just a common female. And then a red brown female. The red brown is not rare. She was from a while ago. But this guy is. And then right here, we have a troll leucistic plains bison. He was 0.2 away from diamond. Then we have a, my, I think my biggest actually diamond gray wolf. Somewhere the smaller decimal is larger than the other 39.8. And then my only albino, which is a female. Up here we have my gold piebald moose from back when I first started the channel. Uh, this is another troll moose. And then the mocha moose from T. Awaroa. Then right here we have my diamond American alligator 525. He was a really, really big one. And then my gold gray piebald. So I think that's a pretty cool multi-mount. And then right here, we have our grand slam. All diamonds. Uh, 200 scoring diamond basit. 104 diamond grados. 91.9 southeastern. And a 110.5 ronda. So this multi-mount will change whenever I get a bigger diamond ibex. But, and it has changed a lot over time. I've added bigger ones to it. But I kind of like how it is right now. So guys, that is the Trophy Lodge. I hope you all enjoyed this video. Let me know what you think down below. Um, feel free to tell me about some of the awesome trophies you've got in your Trophy Lodge. I'd love to hear it. So with all that said, I hope you all enjoyed this video. Hope you have a wonderful rest of your day. And I will see you next time.